Hey friends, Ryan Neff here. It is about 10 to 6 on Friday, June 18th, 2020. Uh, so we're running down Fry Road by this preschool or whatever this is, school in Katy, Texas. It is about 95 degrees outside. But the humidity is only about 40%, so that's not too bad. We are a little over four miles in. We are running the the you've got you've got to be kidding me, right? Meow, half marathon or something. So we'll get back to you shortly. After I pass this dude, so I don't look weird filming. Right, so running a half marathon in the heat. It has been about eight months since we posted our last video. I forget which half marathon that was, but regardless, we still have, or I still have about eight of those virtual half marathons from that pack that Lunchbox bought forever and a day ago. So I gotta knock them out here because I'm getting. A distinct bosom because I haven't been running but about four to eight miles a week if that for like six months but we started doing these because they're not having live races in Houston which sucks I don't like virtuals I think they're it's just not the same anyway but here in a couple months, they're gonna start having them again. So, gotta get my shit together and get these over with. And Lunchbox too will if she can ever quit having pregnancy. So. God damn, it's loud on this road. So. Anyway, we'll catch up with you soon a couple of miles to turn around and then we'll talk about running in the heat and why this is probably a bad idea since i haven't been running so here we go all right we are at about six point whatever let's see almost seven it's been kind of cloudy and the humidity is only like 40%. So even though it's freaking hot, it's not too bad. Although this last mile or so, I made the mistake of chasing somebody. Almost caught her. Not quite. She was moving it. But that'll get you where you're going pretty fast. I mean, that's what you do during a race, right? Try and follow someone. But anyway, running in the heat. People always complain, how do you run in the heat? Well, the short answer is you run in the heat. You gotta give your body time to get acclimated and then it won't be so bad. It's always gonna suck, but at least you'll not die. So best way to get acclimated is just to like start in the spring when it's cool and just kind of let it gradually warm up so you still notice it but it won't be terrible but if you're doing what I'm doing which is going for absolutely nothing to run in one of these damn half marathons in the heat you gotta do a couple things first you gotta have to half-ass idea what you're doing with your nutrition salt and water and all that otherwise you'll get really sick but what am I doing guys? second thing is oh, first couple times you're probably gonna get sick or at least get a raging headache afterwards so started this fully well expecting tonight to suck but we gotta get back into it sorry 
eyes are burning from all the sweat once I stopped running. I stopped having the breeze. So anyway, not bad. Other than the Friday night traffic is loud every time a light chunk of cars goes by. So anyway, we'll check in again here a few miles. See what's going on. Alright, 254-ish, so we're just about home, well that was fun, <clears throat> I am like exhausted, so anyway, hopefully we can do some more of these this summer and knock out the rest of the medals we got over a year ago, anyway, hope your running's going well, see you later, keep it real.